Okay, bass players, this is our training video for Dragon Slayer. Now, with Dragon Slayer, the first thing that we want to check out here is our key signature. And you'll notice that you have one sharp, which is the key of G major, at the very beginning. And this song stays in the key of G major throughout the whole piece. Okay? Mm -hmm. The next thing that I want you to notice is, right after the first note, there's a bow retake. So we'll be moving that bow around in a couple places in here. So be aware of those things that are going to happen. Now, starting at measure four and five, we have a lot. Actually, clear back to measure one, we have a lot of accents. So watch that, and then when you get to a point where those are missing, we want to change the way we bow so that it sounds like we're not accenting. Okay, so that's an important thing that you need to do as far as your articulation with your pieces when you're playing. Measure 11, there is an extended rest. Okay, so I want you to count that one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, and so on. Don't just try to count to 16 during that four measure rest because you'll probably get confused and lost in the orchestra when you try to do that. Okay, uh, down at 37, we've got some pizzicatoing in there. Okay, back to R code 45. Okay, now this piece is going to go fast, but we're going to be taking it uh, really just rather at a working type of a speed, just to get this down so that we are uh, comfortable and secure in the piece before we try to get the speed up. Never try to practice something fast at the beginning and just learn the mistakes and get good at playing things incorrectly, which doesn't seem to make sense, but sometimes it's really tempting to do that. Okay, so here we go. We're going to start this piece about one, two, three, four, retake, two, rest, two, two, rest, two, rest, accent, Two. 